Lactobacillus acidophilus has been included in performance DFM. It actually obtains its energy by converting glucose through to lactic acid, uh, which is then further fermented to volatile fatty acids that are, are called acetic acid and propionic acid. These two acids are very important volatile fatty acids within the cow's system. They actually provide the cow with a lot of her metabolizable energy. So the first the first reason that lactobacillus acidophilus is important is through this increase in metabolizable energy provided to the cow. Um, the production of lactate further down the gastrointestinal tract, so in the intestine, uh, actually performs another function. It drops the pH in the intestine, which actually prevents a lot of bad bacteria from reproducing and multiplying in, in that area. In this way, it reduces a lot of the health problems that you can see in cows. Um, the other function performed, particularly in the intestine, is that the lactobacillus bacteria will reproduce very quickly and they attach themselves to the wall of the intestine on little projections called villi. They can reproduce very quickly um, and they actually take up the space of what... Uh, they take up space where pathogenic bacteria could have attached and could have caused problems. This process is called competitive exclusion and is key to many of the bacteria within DFM. Finally, lactobacillus acidophilus produces a protein molecule called a bacteriosin, which actually actively fights against pathogenic bacteria. So again, it performs a key role in protecting the cow from pathogens.